The recent advancements seen in medicine and science has allowed human beings to realize that what was once only perceived as fiction can now be interpreted as fact and the ability for a longer, healthier life is on the horizon. This could very well mean that in a few more decades, human beings can expect their lifespans to be improved dramatically to the point of near immortality. Though it might sound far-fetched, the incredible advancements made in science and technology are more than self-evident of the inevitability of human immortality being achieved. So today, at Unexplained Mysteries, we will be going over the many different ways that immortality can be accomplished in the coming years and when we can expect to see this. Transhumanism Originally seen as a science fiction-induced philosophy, the belief or theory that the human race can evolve beyond its current physical and mental limitations, especially by means of science and technology, began to form the fundamental and foundational philosophies behind the transhumanist movement. Transhumanism emphasizes the use of technology to not only assist us in our day-to-day -day lives, such as inventive new gadgets and environment-controlling devices, but that our very own physical bodies can be paired up with innovative new technologies to allow us to perform superhuman-like abilities. The original advocation of the transhumanist movement was to support funding for mechanical limbs for those of whom have been crippled or injured that lead to the further fascination of new and advanced abilities such as the ability to view the electromagnetic spectrum, to be able to sense electromagnetic fields, and to the total rejection of the human body entirely that could potentially be replaced with a superior robotic counterpart. In fact, back in 1957, the original proposition for transhumanism was to be able to invent new bodies incapable of feeling pain and theoretically being able to live forever, be replaced and if rendered completely useless, to be able to upload memories and entire likenesses to machines for a new body to be built and uploaded with the memories and personalities of the deceased. This could, in theory, be able to allow humans to live much longer lives, if not forever. Rather than treating your body as yourself, you would be able to treat your body as an interchangeable vessel, able to be swapped out, upgraded and replaced if necessary. Genetic Manipulation Another revolutionary advancement in medicine is the prospect of gene coding via the use of genetic manipulation. There are labs all around the world currently working at the idea of using viruses as delivery mechanisms to help rewrite DNA at the cellular level and aid in these gene writing processes. Given the fact that viruses already perform this action of rewriting human DNA at the RNA level to replicate, these new advancements have been more than promising. The current working hypothesis is to create a laboratory virus with the specific genetic code to rewrite DNA and change the genetic code in every cell of a human being, essentially allowing humans to rewrite their genetics as they see fit. Considering the process of aging is written in our DNA, scientists could then work to slow down aging or to even stop it altogether once a person reaches their prime age in adulthood. Paired with the genetic enhancements of other advantages such as regenerative growth, limb regenerations, stronger muscles, and denser bones, the possibility for the application of such technology is limitless. As unbelievable as this might sound, work on this technology is nearing completion, and we may begin to see small-scale uses of such a technology in the immediate future. The Human Genome Project, which was an international scientific endeavor to map out the entire human genome and the functions of genes and DNA. This has helped research scientists uncover which genes and pieces of DNA are responsible for the many functions of the human body, which, in turn, allows researchers to better understand genetic mutations and will help to contribute reliable ways to evolve the human genome in the future. By treating the mechanisms of our body similar to that as machines, we could, in theory, very soon begin perfecting the human body in ways never before imagined, allowing even the human race to live for an incredibly long time. Quantum Immortality Advancements in quantum mechanics and within the realm of quantum physics shows that our universe may not actually be alone in its existence and that we may be one universe out of an infinite variation of parallel universes that exist. This collection of universes in quantum theory is referred to as the multiverse 
and is still widely debatable to this day whether or not it truly exists. However, developments in string theory and subsequently superstring theory believe that they have more than found proof of parallel universes existing alongside ours, and that not only do they exist, but that different variations of ourselves exist amongst them as well. This has led to the overall theory of quantum immortality. Due to the fact that it might be impossible for humans to experience life after death as death might prove to be a variation of inexistence and it is absolutely impossible for humans to experience inexistence, there is a popular belief among the scientific and philosophical community that you will only ever always exist in the universe where you never died. Universes across the multiverse do not have to follow the same rules, logics and physics of our universe, and due to this, it is mathematically plausible that out there within the multiverse exists a version of you that will end up becoming immortal through some means or another. That means if an accident were to occur and you happened to be put in harm's way and didn't survive, if you couldn't experience life after death, then your experience of that universe will cease to exist. However, in a parallel universe where you were barely out of harm's way and survived, you continued on living. Given this possible rhetoric and thought experiment, your persistent consciousness could merely be the lucky variation of you that happened to be in the parallel universe where you lived, thus meaning that you will only ever always live in the universe where you survived and benefit from this theory of quantum immortality. Artificial Superintelligence and Nanotechnology Though this might seep more into the idealisms of the transhumanist movement, the advent of artificial superintelligence will no doubt bring a rise of incredible technological innovations that will rival the collective intelligence of all humanity. Originally described as Moore's Law, the intellectual capability and overall processing power of machines will rise at an exponential rate in the years to come, which will very soon surpass even human intelligences. This means that as more research and effort is put into creating more realistic artificial intelligences, we will be able to develop technologies created and designed by these higher intelligences that can make revolutionary breakthroughs in biological knowledge and robotic enhancements. In fact, by utilizing advanced nanotechnology with artificial superintelligence, our body could be in a constant state of aid and repair with the artificial superintelligences using the nanites as tiny maintenance robots helping to fix, repair and maintain every living cell inside our body. So rather than completely abandoning our organic bodies as seen in the transhumanist movement, we could more accurately pair ourselves with an assistive artificial intelligence that could work to not only enhance us but to ensure our longevity into an everlasting and immortal life. This artificial intelligence could then evolve as we evolve, helping us to adapt to new environments, increasing our mental capacities and even holding our information, memories and our personality to be rebuilt organically if our body faces a tremendous amount of damage and cannot be repaired. Acting as an almost state of suspended animation to allow ourselves to be resuscitated at a later time, if able. Not only could this help to bring us back from the dead, but could also allow us to live longer and fuller lives without an end in sight. Building a time machine Seen as more of a proactive move rather than a reactive move is to use the creation of a time machine as a method of gaining immortality. If one could build a time machine and create looping connections with his past and present self, he could be given complete advice from his future self in a never-ending loop which will allow him to remain 10 steps ahead of everything and persist his own life. Essentially, with the freedom to move throughout time without limitation, having access to future technologies, knowledge of future and past events, and being able to go back in time to ensure the safety of your past self while being aided by your future self, you could lock in a never-ending looping timeline in which you could never be defeated, overwhelmed, or die. Since recent advancements in string theory and superstring theory, it is becoming overwhelmingly self-evident that time cannot be changed, and so by actively securing your own timeline, you will essentially be ensuring your existence until the end of time as we know it. In theory, if your future self passes away from heart disease before they were able to get treatment, your past self could make changes to their diet to ensure the safety of his future self, and with the future self's safety ensured, the future self could ensure the safety of the past self and so on. 
Though this might seem complicated, it is a simple variation of the grandfather paradox, but with the goal of ensuring immortality, which could demonstrate time travel as being both the greatest weapon as well as the greatest defense imaginable in the universe. But what do you all think of the research and efforts currently being worked on to achieve immortality in the near future? Be sure to leave your questions and answers in the comment section below and help us to grow this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos. Thank you.